people I had some weird dreams last night I can't remember them but I do know that they did not resolve the issues that I was having with writing yesterday so still something I need to think about I lately I've been listening to podcasts while I'm at work instead of music and I can only do so much thinking when I'm listening to somebody talk in my ear and it has to be <laughs> set forward to work before I could listen to music work and also go through issues in my story so part of me is like maybe I should listen to music today and the other part of me is like I'm really enjoying this backlog of Hamish and Andy podcasts so we'll see it's another beautiful day today it's supposed to get up to I think like potentially a high of 25 26 which is crazy I don't think it's actually gonna get there but that's awesome. It's supposed to be nice all this week. Ah, I love it. And then I guess like the last bit of news is I'm moving. I'm not crippled sore, like so sore I can't move. I'm a little sore around the edges, especially like my arms because I've upped my weights on my arms. I've been doing but it's totally manageable which is nice. And yeah, I think that's about it. I'm gonna go have my breakfast drink because I am starving and get to work and see where the day takes me. It should be a short shift today because Tuesdays generally are, especially when I work on a Monday, so that is nice. So just a quick shift and um, then I'm gonna meet up with my mom because she's doing a shop downtown. She should be down around noon. We'll go hang out. It'll be awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go because I'm like, I'm starving. Alrighty, so I have made it home. It was a short day at work like I expected. I managed to get to the store, get a few things, mostly just to make my shredded chicken because it's a great snack post-workout. <laughs> I feel like such a loser. Anyway, I also picked up my Easy Mac because yesterday I went to the store and that was the thing I was going for and I forgot when I got there and I ended up coming home with nugget potatoes and garlic bread, which the garlic bread was amazing, but it wasn't what I was going for. And I mean, it's cool even if I picked it up, it would have been nice, like that's fine if I had picked up the Easy Mac as well, but I didn't. Anyway, it is just after one now, about quarter after. I'm gonna probably take some time to tidy my room today because I didn't the other day and also change into some more comfy clothes and then um, try to get some editing done. <laughs> I'm really excited about it. Mm, I'm not excited for it at all, but it'll probably work out. Worst case scenario, I just skip it. I can do that, it'll be fine, but still. Mm. Okay, so I've done pretty much nothing. I put on my chicken. I can't remember if I put that on before or after I vlogged last, but it's cooking in the slow cooker now. I made my bed, but then I laid in it for a while, so does it really count? <laughs> and um, that's about the extent of what I've done so far. I've changed though into workout gear, so I'm gonna go get my daily workout in. <laughs> and then when I'm done, I think the chicken should be just about done. I can pull it out, shred it up, and then I got my snacks for a while. And um, I'm not gonna go into work tomorrow. I had thought about it, but I spent some time planning and organizing my schedule for the next couple weeks. And I think I can get away without going in, which is exciting. But I do think I want to, for at least the next two months, get back into using my journal a little bit more agenda, whatever you want to call it, because I haven't dropped any balls yet, but I feel like there's a chance I'm going to miss something, and especially because, like I said, I'm, like I've mentioned many times before, I'm going away in less than two months now, and so there's stuff that I need to do in preparation for that, and once June hits, it's going to be a mess, so if I can just plan everything out a little bit more, I think it'll be better. Also, I like checking things off on lists and I've been bad at making a list and yeah, so I'm gonna hopefully get into using my agenda again and um, that coupled with the calendar should make my life a little bit easier. So yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna go work out now though and I will catch up with you when I'm done and when I'm dying, but somehow making myself healthier. Okay, so it's like six o'clock now and um, 
I finished working on it a long time ago. It didn't go well. I wasn't feeling the greatest. My tummy was hurting, but I was like, oh, it's fine. I'll push through. And then no. So didn't do a lot of cardio. Still did a little bit of the weights and the stretching stuff. Not, not my best day, moment, whatever. I Then I ate some food, finished shredding my chicken, etc. Came down here and um, chair haven't really been doing much more <laughs> since for like the last I'd say hour hour and a half if I'm being honest so yeah I'm gonna try I'm just gonna watch another YouTube video I think and then I'm gonna try to focus and start writing oh actually you know what I started setting up my agenda so that's a lie when I said I haven't done anything for the last hour and a half I probably took at least half an hour with my agenda so there we go Anyway, yeah, that's where we're at. I just realized that I haven't updated it since I jumped up into the gym and, like, did nothing. But it's cool. I tried. It's the thought that counts. And sometimes I lifted a couple weights. It's the weights that count. I don't know. Anyway, um, hoping to get a bunch of editing done today. And then I think my plan for tomorrow will be to do a bunch of filming. Hopefully. Fingers crossed it'll happen. And, um, yeah, so I do want to get, I want to try to get at least 4,000 words done today, because if I get that done, I'll feel better about the dismal performance I had yesterday. But, the problem is I'm still in the same spot. Uh, we'll see. I'm sure it'll be fine. It's not going well. <laughs> it's a quarter to nine now. I have just been struggling to attempt to start writing. I've decided that chapter 10 and 11, well chapter 10 for sure, and then the potential extra chapter of chapter 11, I can't decide if I want to keep them right now, if I want to split the pertinent information in them to other chapters, if I want to do it in one chapter, if I want to expand it to it that extra chapter, I don't know. I can't decide. It's causing me way too much stress to think about it so I've taken a couple more notes and I'm gonna skip now every time I look back at my notes though I'm leaning towards if not one big chapter or like one chapter that encompasses everything I want that second chapter I'm leaning towards the second chapter but I'm not sure and I'm just yeah just so much stress I've been sitting here just listening to one song on repeat for probably the last 20 minutes just trying to like zen so I can write and it hasn't been working. I'm trying but it's not going well. So yeah that's that's where we're at. At least that's about quarter to nine. I'm gonna put the headphones back on and if I can get through chapter 12 or chapter 11, I don't know what chapter it is now, whatever the next chapter is, if I can get through that I will feel happy. So that is the goal. I don't care how many words it is. I don't even care if it's 10 words. It's more than 10 words. But I just need a win. So that's what I'm going for. Hopefully we'll make it. I don't know. Ugh. I just need to get past this spot. No matter what I do, I need to get past this spot. That's, that's where we're at. So in bad news, like I did get back to my computer and I finished what was written of that chapter, but I need to add a bunch more to it. So I just stopped. I did, however, get about 200 words more than yesterday done. So that's a win. But in good news, I realized I'm bad at math. We know this. We definitely know this. I'm terrible at math. But um, when I was doing my calculations for this month, I don't know what I did. Like maybe I misplaced a five, maybe I put 150,000 instead of 105,000, but um, I don't need to write over 5,000 words a day <laughs> to get this done by the end of the month. Starting from day one, I only needed to write 3,400 words a day to finish it by the end of the uh, month, and at the rate I'm going, it's less than 3,000 that I have to write a day now to get it done, and I don't know what happened. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing that I put 150,000 instead of 105,000. That's the only thing I can think of that would account for that much. But yeah, so I'm actually in better shape than I thought I was. So that's exciting. We can keep my 4,000 words a day goal as a legitimate goal now and not panic when I don't hit 5,000. So these last two days have sucked, but it hasn't been the end of the world now. I mean, it wasn't anyways. I was ahead enough that it was going to be fine, but now, now it's really okay. But Tomorrow I need to get back on this, on this train, go, go, go. 
I want to try to film tomorrow, so that's going to be fun because that's like another, that's a lot of time out of my day to film as well. But I need to film because I have to get a video up on Saturday. And by Saturday, I mean Sunday. So yeah, lots of stuff to do tomorrow, but less panicked about the writing bit because I'm not in as bad of shape as I thought I was. So yeah, that's awesome. And I actually kind of had a bit of a flow and the only reason I'm stopping is because it's like 11 o'clock and I want to go to sleep. The, and I mean, the rate it was going wasn't very good anyways. So with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night. Thank you.